what's up you guys so i had to make a new part of the beginning part of my video um so pretty much this video is going to be about me trimming my natural hair pretty much if you want to take my tips advice because i know some people out there that are probably like me didn't know how to trim it but over the years i officially learned how to trim off my damaged ends and split ends so to say also in my video if you see me cutting off like a lot of hair don't be like surprised and anything because you probably have less damage ends than me but i haven't like trimmed my ends in god knows how long so that's the reason why i was like trimming off so much um because i really tried to get rid of a lot of dead ends that i didn't need because your hair won't grow if you have all those dead ends and another thing is just that i did cut them with like hair scissors i wouldn't suggest going to the kitchen get some kitchen scissors or any other type of scissors so do cut your hair with hair scissors but yeah i just had to record this part over explaining what i'll be doing in my video so let's get into the video before we get this video started as y'all can see i officially changed my channel name to swain tv if you haven't heard or reason why i changed it um go watch my new year's resolution video explaining my new year's resolutions for this channel and also give this video a thumbs up if you have been here since day one and then also subscribe to my channel for more videos like this because i do plan to do a lot of like hair like natural hair stuff as well in my channel so yeah subscribe and stay tuned for more okay so basically getting down to it i already like oiled and conditioned and detangled this side already i'm only gonna do this side because i don't want this video to be so long but i'm only gonna do this side and pretty much i'm gonna be repeating what i did on this side to that side also this is freshly washed hair another thing i'm not like a hair professional nothing i just know my hair to be honest <laughs> so you can take my tips you can't you know but one thing i do know about trimming my ends and everything is just that when you're trimming them i always look for like the see-through part because pretty much the see-through part is the ugly parts those are what you need to cut off okay so i already got a part in two sections then i'm gonna take it again and just ooh, part that i'm just detangling my hair some more that does not sound good <laughs> that's how i know i need to give my hair some more care okay i'm just gonna start off in the little section first i don't know why but i always like to take like a fine tooth comb and comb through and make sure i got like all the tangles out and stuff. All right, so when I said see three inch, y'all can see that. Like how that is see through. I'm sorry, I just looked at my lips. I felt like they was dry. So y'all see that? Yeah, you don't want to get rid of that. Cause through here, you can see like it's dark and everything, but these ends don't look too hot. So yeah, you don't want to get rid of that. Ooh. Till mine's really needed a trim. Oh, I don't want to sweep. <laughs> so I'm going to drop it off so I can just pick it up once I'm done. Okay. Ooh. Okay, now you see how it looks now? Much better than before. <laughs> I'm going to see if I can do it side by side. But as you can see, it's much better. Ain't no see-through. So that's what you pretty much do. Um, I just part my hair to like two sections. Then I split the two. Well, split one of the two. And then just take a little small section. Detangle. Snip. Until I'm done. You guys bear with me. This is like my first actual hair tutorial. Oh, I have done some back then in the past but i didn't know what i was doing and right now i ain't used to it so of course over the time when i get used to it i'm gonna be you know a pro at everything see this is kind of like out of the norm because i'm used to doing like sit down videos and everything not like an actual tutorial video so <laughs> yeah also I do plan to like do a lot more girly so probably even makeup now I can give y'all a beginner's look because your girl is a rookie like when I say a rookie I am a rookie <laughs> I'll be doing what I'm doing but we looking good all right so I got that detangled out start off with your wide tooth comb just to detangle it more then I start off with my fine tooth comb you can use it if you want to I like just really just do it just to 
I don't know. I feel like I need that extra comb through, so to say. And here we go. Excuse me, y'all. I'm like left hand, right hand, so <laughs> I'm trying to debate which hand I want to use. Okay, as you can see again, yee, terrible, terrible, terrible. Let me just take my scissors. Please do not cut yourself, but I do take my scissors and just cut really slow. One thing I can say was beneficial. Remember in the beginning when I was just like, you heard all that snapping in my hair, like, listen. You don't hear it no more because there was some dead ends <laughs> screaming. <laughs> all right. Continuing. Ooh. I don't know what I get up here. I cannot see. I guess I need a tangle gun. But still it's like hard to pull through. This section I'm probably gonna have to divide in two because it's a little long. Yeah, I did not detangle. I can tell it's so thick right here. Y'all hear that snapping again? It's the end screaming. I'm getting all that hair in. Ashamed of myself. Ooh, okay. I'll put it in it right here. Also, comment down below any other natural hair videos you want to see. I'm really good at the whole slick back thing. I may do that tutorial as well, like slick back. Either put it in like my little bun, puff, or whatever I do, or adding hair onto it. And also, I wear the puff. You know, the go to natural hair puff that every girl wear when they're natural. <laughs> I do that as well. I can do a tutorial on that. Especially if you're like transitioning, thinking about going natural and everything. So need some tips advice you can hit me up social media twitter snapchat facebook well i got a facebook page it's swing tv but you can also message me there as well instagram Whew. yeah my arms are getting tired okay so i can see again I can't even see anything. Okay, there we go. I'm just gonna snip that off. Try to make sure y'all can see the sheen spring it to the side for. Them. Make sure I can see some of the hair is pulling away because it's a little short right there. Okay, but I ain't been having time for my hair because that's another reason why it's all. Like, it's hard to detangle right now. I've just been, y'all, I've been horrible. I'm going to tell the truth. I have been horrible. I ain't trying to get on here and pretend like I've been a natural hair guru <laughs> since the time I actually been natural. And it's been like since 2012, 13-ish. Yeah. Not letting me be great. Oh, my arms hurt. And that's the reason why I kind of don't do it. <laughs> you know, a lot of people do be talking about how natural hair is a lot of work. They're right. I ain't gonna lie, it is. But you just have to find time to be honest. Like today, I got time. And I plan for this year as well to keep at it. 
Some people be freaking out over this. If you see me like cutting again, it's because I see like some hair that didn't get cut in it. I can't say combing through this. It's a lot easier. And I don't hear it snapping at the end no more. Like my hair actually feels way better than what it felt like when I was washing it, putting conditioner in it. And pretty much I'm just continuing all the way up until I get to the front part of my head. Sometimes it does get a little tricky. You can see how it's still full and everything. It kind of like matches this. But I just go ahead and just still snip it off a little bit. I guess I can bring it in the front. Like, this is what I'm talking about. Like, how crazy it looks like that. It doesn't look like that after you cut it. See? Woo! Definitely could tell. It don't look like that after you cut it. All right, so we're done with this side. I'm gonna do this side off camera. Also, if you have any more questions or anything, need me to go more in depth with it, just feel free to comment or DM me on my social media. So I'm happy enough to help. And I will see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it. And also subscribe if you want to see more hair videos. Subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you guys later.